I'm Andrew Williams and this is Throwback Thursday, where we take a look at great ads from the past and see if there's any lessons that we can learn today. In the last episode, I looked at the work of John Webster, and particularly his feeling for place and community. Now I want to take a look at his creation of characters. He could create a brilliant personality around a brand, whether it be Crest of Bear to the Smash Aliens to the Sugar Puffs Honey Monster. Webster grasped that if you could match a brand with a funny and distinctive character full of personality, you'd have an unforgettable commercial campaign. When I worked at Disney's promo department, I co-created a character called Raoul the Dinosaur, and I saw firsthand the magical way that people would react to a talking monster or character. Look at the Honey Monster for Sugar Puffs. Webster took the idea of parents referring to their kids as little monsters and ran with the idea. So he had a monster that, like kids, loved sweet things. He combined that with reimagining the Muppet Show's Cookie Monster and hey presto, he'd created the Honey Monster. Then he matched this anarchic monster with a dry, stuffy English presenter as his straight man. Tell him about the honey, mummy. The perfect comedy setup. It was naughty, the monster did lots of things kids would love to do, destroying a smashing thing. It was bizarre, a giant hairy monster and a stuffy English gent, but the monster was also cute. To quote Jules from Pulp Fiction, personality goes a long way and John Webster had a storyteller's knack for creating funny and memorable characters to represent the brands he was advertising. These days, lots of busy mums are noticing that their favorite mashed potato rattles. This is because it contains the real potato pieces that ensure a mashed potato that tastes absolutely perfect. Mm, that is good. And we think you'll find nothing else will seem quite the same again. Or mash, get smash. I'd like to introduce you to Honey Monster. Mummy. I'm not his mummy. <laughs> now, to help a honey monster through the morning, I give him breakfast, including sugar puffs and milk. Tell him about the honey, mummy. Pieces of natural wheat, puffed up and tasting of honey. Honey, the taste of honey. I love my honey. I love my mummy. I love my honey, mummy. So, if anyone asks why sugar puffs taste so good, remember... Tell him about the honey, mummy. Hi, man. This is Cresta's new flavor, black currant. I wonder what. <laughs> Timber! Black currant flavor, huh? That's okay. Cresta, not in five fruity flavors. It's fruity, man. <laughs>